Good evening, everyone. This is a video review of the Aplos head-mounted flashlight. So it does come with this nice adjustable headband, but hey, it could also be snapped right out and used in your hand without this neat little head clip. But I'll just keep it in there for now. So uh, it is rotatable just like this. So you could rotate it up and down depending on how you need it. As you could tell by that little design, that's the power switch. So that is also, and I'll take it out to actually show you this part. You unscrew this, and that's where you get the USB-C charging port right there. And it does come with a cable. Um, and then the battery, you unscrew this in to access the battery. It has a little battery mark right there even. And it's a 3,000 milliamp hour 18650 rechargeable battery. And those are definitely known for long battery life and high power. All right, there's three LEDs there behind that lens. So we snap it back in there. All right, so let's go through the settings of this. I'll turn off this other light that I have here. All right, so that's low setting. And there's a street light on that side. So let's just shine it at this tree. This tree is about 20, 25 yards away, not too terribly far. That one over there is probably about 50 yards, maybe 40 yards. Let's go back to this one so we could see the more of the change. Let me adjust my light just or my camera just a little bit. Okay, back up at the tree. Okay, there's medium mode and there's high mode. There's the strobe mode. And there's SOS mode. So I'll keep this pointing out in the field for just a second. All right. So the low mode is not retina burning. It is not, I mean, you don't want to look directly into it, but it's, um, I don't remember how many candle power, but it is, or lumen, but it is not like you're just, trying to light up a whole city block. Um, the medium or mid-range, we're getting there. The bright mode is definitely pretty bright. It's, uh, I believe it's upwards or maybe a little more than a thousand lumen. And looking out there in that field, I would have to agree. You know, I don't have a a meter to tell you how bright it is. My meter is my eyes telling me that it's bright and I could see a long ways away. And when you shine it up close, it lights up all around. But um, yeah, that tree that's 45 to 50 yards away, you could see it very clearly. So the good thing about this light being rechargeable, you could use a power bank. You don't have to have a wall socket to plug in and uh, charge it. You could just use a power bank. And depending on the size of the power bank, you might be able to charge it uh, several times, not have to buy batteries, not have to keep expensive batteries. I mean, you could even buy a spare 18650 rechargeable and keep it charged and that way you don't have to wait for this thing to charge back up to use it again but it's a uh, very useful light 